Number three, a balanced chemical equation allows you to determine the mole ratio of any two substances in the reaction. That sounds pretty good to start, but I'm going to read through the other options just to make sure. B, energy released in the reaction. Well, we just talked about in number two that the energy required to break bonds is not a topic of stoichiometry, so I actually don't like that one. Electron configuration of all elements in the reaction. We haven't done electron configurations um, in, in a couple of chapters here. They're still very, very useful to be able to do, but we haven't actually done any in a while, so that should be um, a clue that we're not using that one. Uh, D, reaction mechanism. Holy cow, we definitely haven't covered reaction mechanisms yet, so that's not even in the ballpark. So yes, I am going to go with A.